Well, good morning to you. Um, I suppose it's about time to get on with the biology predictions for 2019. Okay, so I'm going to start off with the predictions for what I think will come up in the long questions in the biology this year for ordinary level. So obviously number one and two are ecology and genetics. Number three, yeast and fungi. Number four, human reproduction. Number five, the nervous system. Six, skeleton and muscles. Seven, urinary system. Eight, lungs and breathing. And nine, respiration. Then for the experiments, and I would say if you know around the first seven or eight of these, you should be covered for the exam. One, quadrat study of a named plant. Two, show the effect of light or CO2 concentration on the rate of photosynthesis. Number three, investigate the growth of leaf yeast. Number four, um, show the factors essential for seed germination. Five, test for protein uh, or reducing fat sugar, food tests in general. Number six, extract and isolate DNA. Seven, immobilize an enzyme and use it. Number eight, dissect the heart. So there are the ones for ordinary level. Now, on to the higher level. I'd say for the long questions, obviously genetics and ecology are almost guaranteed each year. Three, human reproduction. Four, photosynthesis. Five, digestion. Six, yeast and other fungi. Seven, urinary system. Eight, lungs and breathing. Nine, plant sex. And ten, uh, xylem, phloem and all that shit. Uh, the vascular tissues. Right, then for the experiments, your most likely one up is to show the effect of the growth regulator IAA. Two, the effect of temperature on enzyme action. Number three, dissect the heart. Number four, isolate DNA from plant tissue. Often an onion is used for that. Five, the effect of heat denaturation on enzyme action. Six, show digestive activity during seed germination. Seven, immobilize an enzyme. 8. View a TS of a dicotyledonous stem under a microscope. 9. Show the effect of exercise and pulse or breathing rate. And 10. To use yeast for ethanol production. Okay, so that's pretty much that. Have a wonderful biological time. See you later. <laughs>